Hey everyone, welcome back to Truehost Academy. Are you ready to set up and manage your email with cPanel? In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to configure your cPanel email so you can start sending and receiving messages like a pro. Whether you're setting up an email for your business or personal use, this guide will make the configuration process super easy for you. First, let's log into your cPanel account, open your web browser, and type in your cPanel address. It's usually something like https colon slash slash yordo domain.com slash cpanel or https colon slash slash your domain.com 2083 just replace your domain.com with your own domain name you'll need your cpanel username and password which your web hosting provider gave you when you set up your account enter those and hit login once you're logged in you'll see your cpanel dashboard scroll down until you find the email section this is where all your email management tools hang out click on email accounts to start setting up your email now let's create a new email email account. Click on create in the email account section. Enter the email address you want to create like info at your Choose a strong password or click generate to get a super secure one. Confirm your password, set your mailbox quota if you want, and then hit create account. Great job! You've created your new email account. Now let's fine tune the settings. Head back to the email section and click on email accounts again. Find your new email account and click manage. Here you can set up email forwarding, autoresponders, and more. Want to forward your emails to another address? No problem. In your email account settings, find forwarders. Click on it, then add forwarder. Enter the address where you want your emails to go and hit Add Forwarder. How about setting up an autoresponder? It's easy. In your email settings, click on Autoresponders, then Add Autoresponder. Fill in the subject and message you want to send automatically, set a delay if needed, and hit Create. Now, let's connect your email to a client like Outlook or Thunderbird. To get your email client up and running, you'll need specific settings from cPanel. Here's how you find and use them. In your cPanel dashboard, go back to the email account section and click connect devices next to your email account. This will display the settings you need for your email client. Here's a quick breakdown. IMAP settings, server host name, imap.yourdomain.com, port 993, security, SSL, TLS, authentication, normal password, pop three settings, server host name, pop.yourdomain.com, port 995 security, SSL, TLS authentication, normal password, SMTP settings, server host name, smtp.yourdomain.com, port 587 security, startles authentication, normal password. Now let's set up these settings in your email client. I'll show you how to do it in Outlook and Thunderbird. Open Outlook, go to file, add account, and enter your email address. Choose manual setup and select IMAP or POP3 depending on your preference. Enter the incoming and outgoing server details we just covered along with the ports and security settings. Click Next and Outlook will test your configuration. If everything's correct, you're all set. For Thunderbird, click on Menu New Existing Mail Account. Enter your name, email address, and password. Select Manual Config and input the same server details. Click Done and Thunderbird will connect your email account or you can use webmail directly from cPanel. Log into cPanel, go to the email account section and click check email next to your account. Choose your preferred webmail client like Horde, Roundcube, or Squirrel Mail. Alternatively, you can access your webmail through https colon slash slash your domain .com 2096. Once you choose your webmail client, you can start sending and receiving emails right away. Each webmail client offers unique features. Let's also cover how to delete an email account, manage Manage email filters and set up spam filters. To delete an email account, go to the email account section in cPanel. Find the account you want to remove and click delete. Confirm the deletion and the account will be permanently removed. To manage email filters, go to the email section and click email filters. Choose the email account you want to manage. Click create a new filter, name it, and set the criteria and actions. Click create to save the filter. To set up spam filters, go to the email section and click spam filters. 
toggle the spam filters to on and adjust the spam threshold. You can also enable features like auto delete to remove spam emails automatically. Click save to apply your settings. And that's it. You've got everything you need to configure your cPanel email and start managing it like a pro. Thanks for watching True Host Academy. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tips and tutorials. Happy emailing.